Hello and welcome. Your computer probably has an audio panel at the front, you know, for plugging in headphones or microphones, but you need to connect it to the mainboard first. So where are the connectors and where's the cable? We'll figure this one out. And I got uh, three computers to show you different situations, although they are quite similar. So let's uh, figure out how to connect the front audio panel. Before we start, let's make sure that you actually have one. Sometimes they are not part of a case, but uh, an extension that you can add, like these card readers, for example, here, in the upper part, that is. Also, they're not always green and pink and not always at the front. This case, for example, has them here. They are both black. So you have to pay attention to the icons to figure out which one is which. Left is headphones, right is microphone. But often they use the classic colors. Bright green is headphones, pink is microphone. And you can usually find them next to the USB ports. We're gonna start with this computer because it has the biggest case and the most open one right now. I mean, just look at this cable mess. So we're gonna start here because it'll be the easiest. Figuring out where to plug in something can be tricky at times, but this board is actually some good, good signage. Just let's zoom in on this. See this? It says USB in the blue ones, COM in the white one, and audio in the green one, and that's what we want. That's where we need to connect our audio front panel. There are quite some cables, but cable management is quite good in this one. So we're just looking for something thin and uh, one stranded that then connects into this kind of head. Can be white, can be black, can be whatever color. And you just look for text, because this one has... This one has the label HD Audio. Lucky for us. Now what you have to pay attention to is where are the holes and where is that one that is not a hole. I mean, you can also see it from the side. Where there is no metal, there it is blocked. Might be easy to confuse with a USB 2.0 connector, but you can see the label and of course the pins are different. The blocked pin is in a corner instead of in the middle. If we watch real close, we can see that at the bottom left, the second from the left, there is one pin missing. So that's where we plug in this one. And here we go. All done. Of course you couldn't see anything, so let's just get it out. Let's try to do it from the side. Again, remember where the one missing pin is. And there we go. And we just hold it from the side. Don't press from here or you might break the cables. And that's it. Let's check it out on the other main boards though. Now here I would say you should just look at the manual because the manuals usually have a very good map that shows where you find it. Because here you don't have huge labels, you don't have huge color coordination. Oh, I just realized it actually has USB there. I didn't notice that before. And if you pay close attention you can see audio. Actually it's just Audi. J Audi Jumper Audi Jumper Audio. So you can try it this way. And finding the cable is not that hard in here because you only get one HD audio and one USB. The choice is easy. We take the audio one. We remember where the one missing hole is. We check where the one missing pin is. In this case, pay attention. Uh, this one has the missing pin at the top right, second from the right. So you have to be careful and don't assume that it's always the same layout. So this time Gonna plug it in like this. And again try to push from the sides. And that's it. Now what we have here is a more messy setup. The graphics card is still in, the cables are loose. In this case I really would uh, recommend to check the manual if you have a desktop ready and don't have to fight with a producer's website on mobile. Otherwise, you can again try to find the label. This one is actually the oldest of the three, but it does have nice uh, color boxes for USB. And there it is, F-Audio. And again, there's one pin missing, again top right, second from the right this time. Now we just have to figure out where the cable is. It's one of the cables coming from there usually, somewhere from the right. Is it this one? No, this is a nondescript USB cable. So one of these at the bottom actually, this one. And it says audio, because uh, back then HD wasn't as, wasn't coined yet, I think. Not for this anyways. Again, we have one pin missing, second from the left at the top. Gotta align it, make sure not to break any pins. And carefully plug it in. If you don't have enough light, use your smartphone to light it up. 
Again, don't push from the back, only from the sides. All right, we did it. Three computers have their front audio panel connected. So I hope this helped. Please subscribe to support the channel. And I'll see you next time whenever you need some kind of basic computer help. Until then, ciao!